coming back into the fogging tour. Uh, take a nice little slow walk up here and have a brew, I think. This is a present from Chris who I work with. Yeah. It's a Welsh cream, basically like Bailey's, I take it. Looks Ooh. very similar. It smells, don't come in a bottle like this, by the way. <laughs> Nice. We've got a nice warming mm. aftertaste. That is nice. So, what do you say to Chris and Charlotte? Thumbs up. Ideal. Thank you very much. We'll enjoy. Singapore curry. Mm. And a bread roll. And a bread roll. And I've got pot pasta, broccoli and cheese. <coughs> with a couple of bread rolls. And something warming. It is rather chilly tonight. Yeah. I mean, at the moment, I think it's about three degrees, but with the wind chill, close to minus one. Hi. Hi. 
Well, we are spending our first night on Dartmoor in the quarry at Foggin Tor, as it's one of our favourite spots on Dartmoor at the moment. We're missing one other fellow camper, Ian Walker, aka my brother. Sorry yeah. you're not here, you missed, but yeah, I think you'll join us in the Easter one, March or something. He won't be joining us in the February one either, but he has family commitments. He's a lorry driver, so he is away all week. So the only time he gets to spend time with his family is on a weekend. So I can't really blame so him. So we'll do a little shout out now to my brother. So hi bro, AKA Ian Walker. You can also find him on YouTube at Ian Walker. Mm -hmm. Yeah, hope you can enjoy. Give him a like and a subscribe. I'm sure he'll appreciate it. Um, you actually give it colder in the, at, I think at 10 o'clock tomorrow morning, it's meant to feel like minus three with a wind chill. <laughs> um, and it's only actually minus two throughout the night. So uh, It is quite a cold night though. I mean, I'm in my sleeping bag. As you can tell, it's, it's here. <laughs> yeah, I'm wrapped up. It's really bitter. The wind, the... The wind chill is biting. <laughs> it's, yeah. Although it's not as windy as our last camp at Melbourne. I don't know if any of you saw the video. No, that was Storm Dylan? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it was. <laughs> that was hell on earth. That was, it was like Armageddon. <laughs> but yeah, because yeah, um, Ian's tent. Oh dear. Yeah, that yeah. ended up in the bin. <laughs> Let's just say you won't be using that one again. No, he's got another tent already in the pipeline for that one, so yeah. So any more shout outs you want to do while you're on here? you got Bush Crafting and Fishing with the Pikey. He's one of our YouTube subscribers. So yeah, you can go and check him out. Dartmoor Explorer. Viking Outdoors. Bob and Biffy over... Um on King's Tour, did you say the other day? No, Little Miss Tour. Little Miss Tour. Mm -hmm. So again, Bivy, Cliffy, if you're watching, that's for you. Also, Ned Bushcrafter, it's his birthday as well, so I'd like to wish him a very happy birthday. Hope you have a good day and manage to get out and have a camp. Shout out to Gareth and Zoe. They two are pretty awesome. Nick on Dartmoor. Dartmoor Wanderer, Cornwall Outdoors. Right, we're calling it a night. We're gonna have a nice brew, nice hot chocolate and an oval team. So we're checking out for tonight on night one and we'll check in tomorrow. So bye for now. Catch you tomorrow. Good morning. Morning. Oh, it's a very cold night. We're now just uh, having a nice morning coffee. On latte and cappuccino. How'd you sleep? Well, I slept alright. I've been being woken up by you. <laughs> you just don't sleep much. Just the way it is. <laughs> so, got a little bit of mizzle this morning. Still cold. Yeah, nice spot. Very quiet, really. I thought. Hang off. <coughs> <coughs> I'll have to get some water so I can do my boil in the bag all day breakfast. Too Would you have another one of them then? Yeah. There you go. Your <laughs> birthday cake. That's so romantic. You got me cake. A <laughs> musical candle. Blow out your candle then.
night then. You've got, and look what I found, chili con carne Gem from packet. Morrison's. That's if anybody my wants one. Chicken casserole, and Paula's chili con carnies in the MSR window. Yeah, they're quite good value. I think you pay one pound forty nine. It wasn't expensive. Roundup of today was we woke up, had coffee. Weather wasn't the greatest, so we uh, decided to uh, stay in the quarry for another night. Um, we've even had a couple of mad people that decided to strip down to their underwear and jump into the <laughs> uh, into the bit of a lake there. So. Uh, in minus two. Each to their own. And we had tea. Oh, well, I had a uh, chicken casserole. You had chili con carne. Yeah, it was very nice. Yeah, very nice. Definitely uh, get one of them again. I still think my sticky toffee pudding was the best meal I've had. Yeah, I'll probably go for the sticky toffee pudding next time. Mm. The chocolate pudding was alright, but it wasn't the greatest. So we're planning on coming back in February when I've got a week's holiday. And do a weekend. Do you cold? Not anymore. Feet start to get cold. Got the hand warmers out. Put them in my socks. Now I'm toasty. Cool. We did try getting into one sleeping bag. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I thought it was all right. Nice and warm. You just couldn't move. <laughs> but we warmed up. I thought it was quite romantic, personally. Yeah. Why would they get the wrong idea? <laughs> what, the spooning day. leads to forking? <laughs> oh, yeah. Well, we're actually at the end of our camping trip. We're just turning in for our last night. So I'd just like to say, if you like what you see, if you like the video, please give us a like and subscribe on YouTube at Paula and Age. So all I can say is thanks for watching and catch you on the next one. Bye for now. See ya. Heading back to the car for a fried breakfast. <laughs> and it's Baltic. Can you down with that? Yeah, yeah kind of. I'm going to wrap it up with the footprint. We're going to come out. So. Okay, all right.